Alright, what is up my most amazing Media Man fans? This is the Media Man, and welcome back to Life is Strange. This is part two, and if you don't remember where we are, just go back and watch my first video. But uh, we're pulling up to the Step Douche's house, so there you go. Chloe's Step Douche. Bro. Come on in. Don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. Aw. That's sweet. A birdie. And other things. Uh, no. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Alright, uh, let's find some music. Door. Height. Closet. There we go. Music. It won't play without any power. Okay, well, let's plug it in then. Aha! Oh, it's Christmas. Go turn the video on now. Houston, we have the power, but we need to find a disc to play. There's this right there. Can we grab that? And this place is a mess. Think that pizza's any good? I'm hungry. Okay, let's see. Uh, missing person poster, desk, laptop, trash can. And okay, Chloe. A metal box under the bed equals secret. And. Just trying to find the CD. Box. Okay. Uh, I'm missing something here. There's a box. A box. I wonder what Chloe keeps in here. Pictures. Why are there all these CDs and I can't grab them? Why? Too bad I can't stream any music from Chloe's laptop, but I love how funky and outdated it is. She even covered it in punk stickers. Be Too bad I can't stream any music from Chloe's yeah, laptop. Yeah, yeah, we said that. But I love how funky and outdated it is. Hmm. She even covered it in punk stickers because Chloe doesn't give a shit. Yeah, you go, Chloe. Okay, let's look for. Hmm, am I gonna have to search things? I hate to do that. Okay. Damn, Chloe does need a lot of money to get out of Arcadia. Maybe there's something there. We had such a blast drawing these together. Okay, so oh, maybe in a box. I dropped crap. Oh. Dude, you broke my glass snow dough. Thanks. Okay. Look at that. Chloe and her dad were so close. Aw. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's see. We got a power strip. We know that's not going to work. Missing person. I don't think we need to search the garbage. 
I think this junk swallowed her discs. Okay. Need music. Hey, I'm trying, man. Aha. <laughs> hey, give me that. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, she was a good friend. It's putting it mildly. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. I Rachel suck. saved my life. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. Yeah. You laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. I see why. I bet your mom was not too happy. She was happy enough to marry a Nazi. Reason number 356 to escape. I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. Okay. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I believe you. I'm just trying to get all deductive. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. And poof. you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? Let's rock out after all that depression. Anyway, you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Ah, uh, just like old times. Oh, wait. Oh, that's a closet. Let's go find a garage. Door. I'd imagine it's downstairs. Okay, let's see. Don't know this house at all. Hey, I'm for me to problem that guy is. Okay. All right. I haven't seen this place in five years. Seems like forever. I should be able to find the tools I need here. This must be the garage. Okay. There we go. These are way too big. I need tiny tools for that camera. Tiny tools. Those are super big. What? 
Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For real? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? Okay, let's see. Wowzer, a map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. It's a trip, that's why. Okay, let's let us close that. That's not what I'm looking for. And little tools. Little tools. Oh, these look little. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants uh, to put surveillance cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? That guy. No, I didn't know, man. Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? You've got to be shitting me. Nope. Okay. Nothing. This is so lame. It's his car. Sort of. Look at all that food. That's like enough spam for a hundred years. Okay, there's got to be something I missed. Fix that camera. And files. Huh. More food. Okay. That's fantastic. This must belong to Chloe's stepdad. Search. That's all the tools. Okay. Can we open that? Maybe go back upstairs? Boom! Precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. Okay. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Man, I should have done that before they fell. All right, let's do it before they fall then. Okay, let's see. Covered. Push. Brilliant. Yes, you have mad skills, Max. Yeah. Okay. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Yeah. Let's go back upstairs. Before crazy dude comes back. This is a lovely house. Oh, that's the wrong room. This must be Chloe's parents' room. Man, I am nosy today. Okay. That's the bathroom. That's none of my business room. Uh, 
You found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. Nice. Fixing the camera. So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. Wait, I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Yep. Now tell me the truth, Max. I was there. Hiding in the corner. Damn, you're a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? <sighs> I wasn't sure. I know I look a lot different. I was scared too, I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. I was freaking out. I could only hear Nathan ranting. So then you did yeah. hear us. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? Like who? Like anybody. Stop stalling, sister. The principal, but he didn't seem to believe me. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash from Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. I didn't mm. mention you at all. Swear. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. Yeah, you do. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's so cool you remembered my birthday. But I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll uh -huh. snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. <laughs> Old school. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> uh. This day couldn't get any stranger. Oh no. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Huh. R.A.W.K. Yes, break it down, Max. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. Dude, the music's not even on! Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, what's going on? Open this door, please. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. Okay. Chloe. I'm coming. What are you doing? Pause it. Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in now. Please. One second. My bra is stuck. I'm not screwing around, soldier. Try, I'm Chloe, trying. Open this door. Trying, trying. Oh no, oh no, oh no. What do I do? What do I do? I'm giving you exactly three seconds to open uh, the what, door. What? What? One, uh, two, three. Shit. 
What's going on in here? Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here. Stop freaking. She's not a stranger. This is my friend. Great. Another one of your friends. One of my guns is missing. Did you take uh -huh. it? Oh, God, I uh -huh. didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh, yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. It's not my pot. It's from Max. Is this true? Uh, yeah. My pot. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. Like this afternoon. You don't have anything smart to say now, do get you? Get the hell away from huh? her, man. Stop harassing my friends. You don't have any friends. Like you know. You're not even a real cop. You're a fucking security guard. Oh. I was a soldier, Chloe. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. Wow. Nice Thanks to meet for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. Hickle. Man, that did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. I have to think about my own future. Yeah, I'd never say that. I'd never take the plane for drugs. Nope, never. But don't you either, my Muty Man fans. No, no. Okay. Where is we now? Oh dear. Isn't this awesome sauce? Totally reminds me of when we were kids. Come on, slow poke. Hold on. I haven't been here in forever. So why do I feel like I was just here? Dreams. Whoa. This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. Um, let's go. It'll be fine. I feel like I'm in my nightmare again. Birds are so... Huh. <laughs> Lucky, right. they can always escape. Looking good, looking sharp. And shiny outside. Sure, you don't want to be alone? Have a seat, Pete. My pleasure. Feels nice out here after all that drama. You really took one for Team Chloe. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. I should have taken his photo when he flipped out on Kate today. That would be killer blackmail material. Let's bust his ass. He has uh. some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? wish 
You know I would have read them. I'd love to. They must be important or he wouldn't hide them deep in his garage bunker. He kind of creeps me out. I bet the truth is out there in his files. Most likely, but it's good you didn't find his files. He would go ballistic. He's a total surveillance fetish. There were there spy cams in the house. I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it! He's so hella fucking paranoid! I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. What's Nathan's secret? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. So, what about you and Nathan? We went to his room at Blackwell. We drank, and I laughed at his rich kid bullshit. He was one step ahead and put something in my beer. God, Chloe. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. I am so furious, I can't even speak. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous, Chloe. Not just to you. Oh, good thing you notified the principal. I feel safer already. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. Let's go find This shit her. pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Okay. Uh -oh. oh no! Uh, I don't know. Why am I here again? I don't know. Look, it's a reindeer. <laughs> Get it, cause rain. Is... I. Why oh, didn't mean to do that? Oh.
Wait. I've never seen a storm. No, 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 no. Uh oh. Well, that's pretty cool. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just zoned. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But hi, right? Listen to me, how do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. <laughs> I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. <gasps> what the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Hey.
All right, my media man fans, thank you for joining me for part two. As you probably noticed, I don't want to talk too much through most of this because there's so much good dialogue in this game. Uh, so far, loving it. Great story. Gameplay's fun, rewinding stuff and all that. So we will see you in the next video. Thank you for hanging out with me. And uh, please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't. And leave a comment below. Let's talk about it. Let's. Uh, what do you think? Did you guys make different decisions? Have you played this yet? Um, if you haven't and you have a PlayStation and you have Plus, then uh, just download it. It's free. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, thank you guys for hanging out. I love you guys. We'll see you next time. Bye.